Dessa system has classified manufacturing into four trends to follow up on the life cycle of a product. Uh, first, you're trying to be creative, to innovate, to find new ideas for the new product. Then you are trying to capture about the value the product should have. Then you try to do the good decision making in order to have that product you know, as smart as possible. And then at the end of the day, you have to execute. This is a human part. Manufacturing is creative. Now those are two words you don't normally hear together. But in today's economy, there's such a high demand for personalized products and companies are adding so much complexity to their product offerings, it really requires innovation in the production and delivery systems and the willingness to embrace new business models. We believe manufacturing will transform itself to provide more value to its customers. The ever-growing trend of consumers to have more demanding, more on-time, more actually immediate need for customized goods. To provide that kind of value to their consumers, manufacturers are transforming the way they do business by becoming more agile. Now, with this trend of being more personalized, you see that the series are not only becoming shorter, but also the, the partner network is expanding. And it's, that means that sometimes a manufacturer actually needs to establish a supplier partnership even before they actually acquire the products. Manufacturing is smart because it helps to drive performance and agility in manufacturing processes. To do that, we're using both the data-driven and the model-based capabilities of the 3D Experience platform. What's driving the performance is to make sure that this type of data and all of the analytics that we can derive from this data becomes available to every user anywhere in the factory so that they understand the context of every decision that they have to make, they understand the impact of these decisions, and they get guided into this decision to make sure that their decisions are geared towards global enterprise performance target. Human is at the core of manufacturing. Human is the population I talk to when I want to organize my production and I need to tell all those people what I need to do, where I need to do it, how I need to do it. Because they are the people that are executing, I need to help them execute as, as best as I can and make their job as interesting as, as I can. And I have to remove from whatever they have to do all the things which are inefficient for them to be able to focus on the interesting part of the job. So one of the things with those systems that we've been doing is helping companies embrace new capabilities, new opportunities for business model. And one of those is around additive manufacturing. So companies that are looking to explore this technology to reduce their costs of production, they can connect through our 3D Experience Marketplace to those companies that already have that capacity and expertise. Of course, all the engineering capabilities, TLM tools of the Dassault of system can help make that transition very quick by quickly adjusting products or even engineering products to specifications so that the customers can be provided with their goods. 3D Lean is designed to extremely interactively and as a team interact with the 3D Experience platform in order to improve the way we work. And that gives you both a realistic prediction of what's happening now, on top of which, of course, you could do some predictive capabilities for what's going to happen in the future. But because the 3D Experience Twin is model-based, you can play with the future. We don't only have a data science engine, we also have a science engine. We can simulate what-if scenario so that we can configure the future the way we want, keeping in mind that that future should serve our performance target.